Yo, what is up, everybody? Okay. I, I don't I don't even know how to to verbalize this, okay? I, I woke up to this news, and I'm still trying to figure it all out, all right? We finally got another One Piece reveal, and it is Gear 5 Luffy. Now, on top of that, I believe that there was a teaser for the Gear 5 transformation um, for the anime. I, I didn't see it yet, but I, I heard it's pretty fire and, and it's supposed to have the best animators on that episode so you should go check that out but we have this sh figure arts luffy already inbound and i gotta say it's it's pretty crazy because i wasn't expecting another one piece reveal all right that's six figures for the line already um and it just was revived but that's insane and i didn't think that they were gonna go this hard with right on onigashima stuff this freaking fast uh we've got we haven't even gotten any One Piece characters released yet, actually. That's the crazy part, right? Luffy is coming out next month. Uh, then after that, it's Zoro, then Sanji. Uh, and then supposedly after that, it's Kaido, because he's listed on their Shonen Jump website. Um, and then we've also got Yamato somewhere. And now we have Gear 5 Luffy. Now, of course, we have no other real big details on this guy. But I will say it's pretty crazy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It changed for a second. I was like, whoa, what the, what the going with the colors? Um, he's there in person at, I believe, I want to say, yeah, Tomashi Nations Tokyo. He's going to be there. This is crazy, but he's on display at One Piece Day, which I think is ending today. It was the last day, but holy, I, I, I don't even know like how to react. Okay. it It's insane. Now, just looking at the figure. Of course, it looks a little wonky. I mean, he is a cartoonish character in this form. Uh, people were assuming maybe these legs um, will be interchangeable. Or, the other thing being that they are bendable. Which would be interesting because, you know, I don't think that they've really done too much bendy stuff on characters, if at all. And I think it would be really cool as they're starting to really progress into um, softer materials on characters. It definitely can work out. Um, I don't know how that would go on with the arms there, but I assume it could be the same thing if they wanted it to be. But overall, I mean, he still does have that kind of cartoonish look to him. Of course, we're going to have to wait and see how he looks in the future when they, you know, probably work on him a little bit more. Because I can't imagine, I can't imagine that he's going to come out just right away. Um, but it's very possible that they want him to release around the same time as Hybrid Kaido, which is scheduled, according to their website, for... Uh, February 2024 now again I, I wasn't expecting them to go this far and fast into it but it does make sense that they want to have your main protagonist and antagonist together in a scene like that so I'm all for it and oh, I, I don't even know like what to say it's just an insane reveal and there's another close-up picture but wow what do you guys think about that like are you are you guys hyped to see um, them start already getting into transformations for Luffy? Because I was curious how they were going to do that. And I haven't really seen anything manga wise for him. I've only seen uh, different merchandise like resin statues and uh, drawings and stuff like that. And as far as I know, to my knowledge, and I guess this is a spoiler, so click off or mute for the next 30 seconds that he can like manifest whatever he wants to like he can do whatever he wants to the sun god or something like that uh, i've seen one where he literally is like holding a lightning bolt a purple lightning bolt it always seems to be purple which is cool uh so it, i'm just excited for whatever that they end up doing for him um all right spoilers over but at this point that's crazy um i i see chill mp4 there in the comments listen bro listen bro one Piece is better than Dragon Ball right now. Shueisha already knows what they want, bro. Dragon Ball is never coming back. Oh, that's a crazy statement, though. Uh, the fact that they're already doing it because it hasn't had an anime adaptation just yet. It's on its way. It's going to happen. But the fact that they have it beforehand is insane. Um, I will say the cloud kind of or steam effects. I'll be interested to see how they handle that. I feel like maybe that could change a little bit because it also breaks here at the seam. There's like there's a little seam right there, so I'm assuming maybe that there'd be different designs of it. Again, I haven't seen the manga. Um, I've only seen you know merchandise essentially for it. Um, 
so yeah we'll be interested to see what happens definitely is in development still because i don't see any seams here for a toe hinge um and i i can't imagine that that articulation right there is going to remain the same it looks kind of weird um but yeah I, i'm i'm still shocked this is one of the craziest random reveals you could ever wake up to when it comes to tamashi but yeah that that's it i think that this is it for one piece for for a little bit now i they need to chill um and then let's get back over to bleach give me rukia give me yodorichi give me uruhara all right uh aizen you know we need that so we'll see what happens uh, i will keep you guys up to date on this news but holy moly um I'm assuming that news is not too far away either. Uh, granted, they, they're already promoting him on their website, on uh, Instagram, and he's going to be in person to view at Tomashinix Tokyo, uh, which I don't know how far away that is, um, but you can you can go in there any time, I think. They also have a event going on right now. Um, yeah. Jump history. Jump figure arts history at Martian Nations Tokyo store, so you can go check it out if you're down in Japan. Um, it's gonna be really cool. Anyways, that is pretty much it. Um, yeah. Oh man, Gear Five Luffy. Who would have thought? But catch you guys later. Peace. <laughs>